It's not the pale moon that excites me. That thrills or delights me. Oh no, it's just the nearness of you. It isn't your sweet. Conversation that brings this sensation. Oh no, it's just the nearness, the nearness of you. Just the nearness of you. Ella Fitzgerald leaves with us this incredible example and this beautiful stamp about what it really means to be a singer. You have this beautiful calling that has several parts. You know, you're standing in front of the band 
and you have this this job to communicate to the people in a way that makes them feel that they're spoken for you know and then you also have this other obligation to like communicate with the band and really really know the music you know and really be a musician you know with your with your instrument and really take yourself seriously as an instrument and at the same time you you know it would be great if yourself and the people in front of you and the people behind you all felt wonderful you know and so i really love how ella Fitzgerald covered all this territory remarkably well and uh, she would deliver a lyric with such um, a sense of just uh, study and clarity and lightness uh, that you started thinking about what the writer intended so as a singer i think when we are really uh, enjoying the service of what we do we're drawing attention to the songwriters you know and so i always want to know that we're we're singing in a way that lifts them up and it makes the audience and the musicians think about the original poetry or story of a song well we all know that ella fitzgerald is referred to as the lady of song and i just love that title most of all the things we call her because uh you know lady is in a way a bit more accessible and maybe even more endearing than queen you know um, she is queen but i really love how uh, the term lady um, just illustrates a level of, of softness and accessibility, um, of a gentleness. And I tell you, even today, um, when you hear Ella Fitzgerald's voice, you know, um, come just ringing across, you know, the hallway at, a, at an airport terminal or in a cafe, anywhere in the world, wherever it is, um, it immediately creates uh, warmth in that space. It really charges the space with warmth and, and uh, a kind of gentleness. and. Um, and so with Ella being the lady of song, I think every songwriter, every song singer uh, knows her name. And she has given, a, given us a gift and given us an incredible catalog of music um, that tells us what's possible in delivering a lyric and in uh, evoking all kinds of feelings in ourselves and other people. So I'm just so excited. You know, she's a great um, American gift treasure and, and she's really been a gift to the world.